God, I just ask that you, um, uh, that you just speak to us today, Lord, and I just ask that you flow through Macy. We thank you for giving her a word to speak to us, God. I just ask that you use that word as a seed and plant it into us so that it grows and it becomes fruitful, fruitful, Lord. God, I just ask that you um, anoint her mouth so that when she speaks, it just flows and you speak through her, Lord. And I just um, ask that you cover us with the blood of the Lamb, Lord, and give us armor uh, for the rest of our day and the rest of our week, Lord. We thank you for um, gap service last night, God, and we thank you for what you're doing in Invade and our, in, in Fresh Start, Lord. And I just thank you for another great, amazing day. And um, just bless Macy and the word she's about to give. Amen. Thank you, Caitlin. Um, so today, guys, my devo is called A Relationship with God. And this is like something that we like talk about a lot, but it's like we don't really go into like super duper depths about like what that really means fully. So I just want to kind of like elaborate on like what a relationship with God really means today um when I think of the word relationship my relationship with God admittedly isn't usually the first thing that comes to my mind most of us tend to think of our earthly relationships like our friends or family or some of the girls think of those cheesy hallmark movie relationships which that you watch during Christmas in July but most important but the most important relationship of all that of our heavenly father often gets slipped by in the beginning, and not just the beginning we all know in Genesis 1, there is relationship. There always has been relationship. Before God even created anything at all, there was God, and God is the Trinity. This is the divine relationship between the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. John 1.1 1, 1 says, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. This is in reference to the Trinity and shows us how since the beginning of time there has been relationship. Relationship is a fundamental aspect of life. Life began through relationship. Without the relationship of the Trinity, life would not exist. As a culture and society, we have lost our sense of relationship with God. People are letting their earthly relationships become more important than their spiritual relationships. The world has become corrupt because we have lost the true sense of relationship. Christians are caring more about their religion than their relationship with God. They're caring more about the show of Christianity and what others think rather than their real relationship. An example of true relationship is Jesus' disciples. They did not choose to follow and have a relationship with Jesus because of any earthly gain. They did not get any social, political, or religious authority by choosing a relationship with Jesus. In fact, they were persecuted for their decision of relationship over religion. They chose the relationship because they knew that it would fulfill them more than any of their earthly desires. They knew that a relationship with God is vital, not necessarily to our earthly life, because we can obviously live without that relationship, that spiritual relationship on earth, but to our life in eternity. Being religious will not get us into heaven. There is a song called Real Love by Blanca, and if you guys haven't listened to it, I suggest listening to it. And one of the lines says, I see faith turning into a show of Sundays and sermons and words getting caught in the flow. This show that, faith, uh, that our faith is, is turning into, a show that faith is turning into will not benefit us in eternity. It is the true, unfiltered, pure relationship with our Heavenly Father that will truly save our souls. Um, I just want to challenge you guys to look through your life, um, like going into this week or throughout the rest of this week and look at like do you have like a real true relationship with God and are you seeking that true relationship with God are you seeking the show that is um religion and doing it to please others and not for God himself and with that I just want to close this out in prayer 
Dear God, I thank you for today, and I thank you for all these people gathered here today to hear your word, God, and that we're all passionately seeking you out. And I ask you just to give them a desire, Father, um, a desire to have more relationship with you, God, and that um, they want you more than anything else in the world, God. Just let them um, let them just seek you for the rest of their days, God. And um, I just pray that you set their souls on fire with a passion for you, God. And in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed that video. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel. And if you want to stay tuned in for more, be sure to hit that notification bell. And also follow us on Instagram on shaken underscore vessels. That's all we have for today. Thank you.